telling the story earlier this morning. Um, I used to be a sprinter when I was at school. I didn't even say anything in this laughter. That's just rude, really. <laughs> Some of you are like, Kev, that, just, that takes faith just to believe that, brother. I'm, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to build your faith up. It's precisely what I'm trying to do. Legit, I used to be a sprinter at school. You're still laughing here. What's going on here? <laughs> so when you've got family members in the congregation, this is what they do. And um, in particular, I used to be a hurdler. <laughs> I knew if you weren't laughing the first time around, you'll laugh then, because you're looking at my legs going, ha, huh, how is that possible? And so I used to be quite a good hurdler, actually, under 11, I'll never forget, a uh, bit of boasting here, let me just boast a little bit here. Under 11, um, I ran in Greek was. Do you have any clue where that is, Kimberley area? And I, and I broke the Greek record and 11 for 75 meters hurdles, and it stood for quite some time, I'll have, you know. <laughs> anyway, going into high school, I continued to do athletics, and I continued to be a hurdler. And when I was in matric, I went to school a year early, so I was only 17 in matric. It's my 25th um, reunion this year, actually, in October. I'm looking forward to it. But, uh, so in matric, I was 17 years old and continued to hurdle. But in, when you're under 17, it now shifts from 100 meters to 110 meters hurdles. Right, that's the sprint, and the hurdles are about that high, I guess. <laughs> I could literally just run through, but I wasn't allowed to. <laughs> 110 meters hurdles, and they added 300 meter hurdles. Right now, when you're under 19, and uh, we're supposed to be in matric, you're supposed to be 19, you go to 400 meters hurdles. And God was gracious to me. He said, My boy, your legs are short. We send you to school early. You just have to do under 17. 300 meters is your limit. That's all good. But I'll never forget this one, one, one weekend I was competing, and I can't remember if it was a provincial thing. It may have been. And, um, and I was running 300-meter hurdles. Now, 300 meters is a long way, especially for these short legs, I'm just saying. And then you add obstacles in the way as well, right? And so um, I was running in this race, and, and off I go. It's like Mario Brothers. Have you seen it? Have you played that game? The right age group. Anyway, as I come around the bend, 200 meters behind me, the lactic acid begins to set in, right? I mean, you're so stiff, your nose is stiff. I mean, you can't even move your nose. You're running like this. <laughs> and as I came around the bend, I kid you not, as I came around the bend, all I heard was, go, Kevin, go. 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 And I tell you, it just unbelievable what it did to me. My legs got longer, my strides got bigger. I was actually going over the hurdles and not under them. And I can't recall if I won the race, it may have been second place. Um, but incredible as I came around that bend, how this just, go Kevin, go, go Kevin, go. I later, I later realized it was my twin brother who wasn't racing in that race, um, and he had got a couple of mates, and they were just going, Here's what the writer of Hebrews is saying. He's saying, therefore, I've given you all of these examples of people that have gone before you. Therefore, run your race and finish your race strong. 